What's up everyone? In today's video, we're going to check out Lublin. It's a very popular city in Poland. We're going to see some churches, the castle, of course the architecture. It's a very happening place, even though it's freezing today. A lot of people walking about. So let's go check this place out. This is an interesting read. Pause the video if you have to. Europe starts here with a cool black obelisk. Check out this church. Nice red paint with an interesting eye on the top. Hmm. The inside is relatively plain. Nothing much to see here. The outside is better than the inside. But still, it's nice to get away from the cold. Warm up my hands and prepare for the next stop. A cool theater. And check this out. I really like the architecture. This is the mayor's house. Cool building. The church right next to it. And look at this random goat. This is the church we're going to check out. Just a really nice view. Unfortunately, the church is closed. But I can show you how it looks. Nothing much to see. On to the next stop. This is a very cool entrance, and it leads to the city square. Beautiful buildings, nice art on some of them as well. Building art, looks nice. What isn't so nice is the abundance of abandoned buildings. Of course, you can buy them or rent them, whatever. But yeah, a lot of abandoned buildings in the city square. This is some ruins. Also nearby the city square. And it's right next to a lot of abandoned buildings. But on to a positive note. The Basilica of the Dominican Fieras, if that's how you pronounce it. Pause the video if you want to get a good read. Let's check this place out. So right away, I'm impressed. Not only is this place really large, but there's plenty of beautiful statues and artwork. Various art pieces. This is actually Lublin when it had a fire. I really like the green here. It gives this place a very special look.
check out this hidden room in the very back. The ceiling is exquisite. It even has its own organ. Pretty interesting. Very large church. Now we head to this other church, St. John's Cathedral. Very large. And again, very nice view. Out of all the churches I've seen today, this is probably the best one. The art is magnificent. It's also quite large. But best of all has to be the ceiling. Once again, I see that mysterious triangle eye. The art here is really cool. I can definitely spend an hour just staring at everything here. Some art of the angels fighting some dragons. Definitely a cool church. There's the entrance. The ceiling is also really nice. Now I'm heading out. Next stop, Lublin Castle. This is the castle courtyard. We're going to check out the castle museum, as well as the church, and the castle tower. For everything, the price is about $10, like 40 zwote. I'm showing you now the tower of the castle. It used to be a prison. All of these signs are in Polish. But of course you could just use your translation app to see what they say. It's pretty much just a history of the tower. We're starting from the very bottom floor and climbing up to the top. Kind of spooky knowing that so many people were back to back stuck in this place they packed it up to the girl Now for the viewpoint on the tower. The view is quite nice. See the church. A couple churches actually. And over here is the town center. 
now we are inside the castle museum. I wasn't sure what to expect of this place, to be honest with you. But it looks quite nice. Of course, there's a couple paintings, some nice furniture. I'm not very clean. You can hear some of the clocks. They're going off for some reason. Quite a few of them here, actually. This is making me want some fruits. Some beautiful artwork. If you're a fan of art, especially this kind of time period, you can take your precious time and enjoy. Now we're going to check out the church, which is in the castle. And wow. Absolutely stunning. The entire church, the inside is filled with art. Absolutely incredible. I'm absolutely stunned by the castle. I was not expecting to see this kind of art. I believe this is uh, the Orthodox Church, not the Catholic. Now we enter a dark room with a bunch of Orthodox art. Very beautiful. Once again, if you want to get a better look at any of them, just pause the video. The knight firing the dragon. That one looks pretty cool. And that's the end of this room.
They also have some abstract art. I'm not a big fan of this kind of style. But it's still worth a look since I'm here already. Now this is more of my style. I actually like religious art. Even in Thailand, when I went to the art museum, the Buddhist art looked quite nice. Same thing as here with the Christian art. The colors, everything just looks really cool. Tell me not, aren't these colors awesome? This is a replica of Lublin Castle. You can see the tower here. Wow, take a look at this painting. When the Polish were firing the Swedish. A panorama painting of Lublin and even more art. This museum is large. I wonder how many rooms are there. I thought where the church was the end of it, but we're having a bunch of more rooms. Quite nice. Definitely worth the entry fee. This guy is very popular in Polish history, one of the old kings. Pause the video and give this a read. What do you think about this? Spooky? We saw this in one of the earlier churches today. This one looks like a portrait, really well done. And yet another room. This seems to be filled with advertisements of some sorts for movies. Let's check it out. This is Lot Airlines, Poland's most famous airline. I like the colors on these. 
the Beatles. Gotta love it. Now we head upstairs to yet another room. Even more art. For real. The price of the ticket is absolutely worth it. I don't understand this museum though. Why is there so much art here? It's like 90% art in this in Lublin Castle. This one is called Krakow Wedding. So a wedding in the south of Poland. Nice. These are some really cool pieces. Especially this one. This one's nice, like Halloween. This is probably the most disturbing art piece. Really creepy. This one is really cool. Check it out. But this one's probably the best in this room. It's gigantic. Another very nice piece. And now for the final room in Lublin Castle. Check what this one says. Naruto. And that's the end of today's video. Hope you all enjoyed. My favorite part of Lublin has got to be the castle. I was definitely surprised to see so much art pieces. Anyways, catch you all later. Peace.